And Senator Luxon, before I call on Senator Thank you, Mr. Uh, Chairman. Salina. Colonel Bacaro is here. Uh, his presence here, uh, we, we summoned him only to testify on certain matters, di ba? To confirm or deny Matubato's assertion uh, that he made during the hearings here that he was either a member of CAPGU, CHDF, or Auxiliary Force of the Scout Rangers. Kasi kanina nasabi ninyo, uh, SPO3 Las Cañas, na he told you that he was a member of the Auxiliary Force of the Scout Rangers. Yes, Paul. Now, and 14. since Sikar Bakaro is a very busy person, then, being the uh, Deputy Chief of Staff for Operations of the Philippine Army, para may excuse na natin siya after, his, uh, after the purpose of his presence here. Colonel Bacaro, what, what can you say about uh, the, uh, the assertion made by Matubato that he was, once upon a time, one member of CAPGU? Uh, Your Honors, uh, maybe may I be allowed to read uh, the certification Again, issued by uh, the Headquarters Philippine Army. Uh, Commanding General, Philippine Army, Fort Andres Minifacio, Metro Manila, certification to whom it may concern. This is to certify that after thorough verification of the records extant to these headquarters, including the various Philippine Army major units from 1976 to present, a certain Edgar Matubato does not appear to be a member of the defunct Civilian Home Defense Force. This certification is issued for any legal purpose it may serve, issued this end day of September 2016, Fort Andres Bonifacio, Metro Manila, Signed, Eduardo M. Año, Lieutenant General, Armed Forces of the Philippines. How about uh, being a member of the Auxiliary Force of the Scout Rangers uh, or the SR Regiment? Sir, uh, looking at the mission of uh, the Scout Rangers, which is basically to conduct unconventional uh, warfare operations, either in uh, independently or in conjunction with other uh, uh, units, uh, the scout ranger is basically a direct action force, and as such, they will be uh, it will be uh, or they will not be in a position to handle auxiliaries. Uh, this is the mission of the scout ranger, and relatedly on uh, the statement a while ago that uh, uh, Edgar Matubato underwent scout ranger course with the rangers. Uh, this is uh, a little bit impossible, Your Honor, because the scout ranger course is exclusively for active military uh, personnel, Your Honors. In other words, he was lying when he testified before this committee that he was once a member of CAPGU, he was once a member of CHDF, and he was also lying when he told SPO3 Las Cañas that he used to be with the auxiliary force of scout rangers kasi hindi po pwede mangyari yun. Uh, based on the records that we have, sir, uh, yes, sir. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. S can we excuse uh, Colonel Bacaro now? Unless... Uh, our colleagues would want to ask uh, questions. That is based on the record and based on reality that scout rangers will only train scout ranger candidates. Uh, regular members of the <laughs> armed forces. That's, correct. That's what I meant. Yes, yes. Okay, I just wanted to be sure. So, thank you very much, uh, Colonel, for your, I, I'm sorry for your loss of time here, but this is part of our democracy. We have to, uh, you know, try to find out who's telling the truth here. Thank you. And uh, thank uh, General uh, Diagno. I have a letter from him that he could not attend, but he did kindly send uh, you to come over and uh, make the clarification. We'll do that, Your Honor. Thank you very much. Uh, so the next, uh, yes, uh, the witness uh, from the Philippine Army, Bartolome Bacardo, Colonel, is, uh, Bacaro is excused. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you.